Well, hello again. Good afternoon from another city, another country. Baku, the capital of Azerbaijan. And it is an amazing city, which I'll show you more of in due course. And I've got plenty of ventures lined up for Azerbaijan. But before any strenuous activity, it's of course important to warm up. So just a gentle one today. I've heard there's a fort around the city limits, which is, well, I've heard it's a little bit odd. So we'll get down, we'll check it out, and uh, yeah, get the trip started. Onwards and Slava Ukraine. I'm on the wrong side of this vast interchange for my bus. So I have to, uh, have to go through the rat runs. Can't, can't go through on the metro. It's not floor. You have, well, you have, to, you have to pay again to get through the turnstiles. Anyway, uh, just got the metro to Koroglu and then a little bus to, uh, to the fortress. Yeah, onward. Okay, okay. Thank you very much. I mean, this this trip is just. I mean, it's always got off to a brilliant start. We've got some urban decay and we got help by some lovely babushkas. So yeah, this is the, metro, this is the uh, sort of where the suburban buses leave from. So this is the one we want. 214 is our number. Well, we're off the bus and we've been dumped by the side of a dusty highway as all good adventures start. Um, oh, this is portentous. Um, kind of got the wrong bus, so uh, uh, we have to walk for a little bit. And we're fighting against the dying of the light. Uh, we've got plenty of time there. I think we'll be, we'll be okay. I can see the castle, about 50 minutes away. So yeah, we'll be there soon. Are you excited? I know I am. Please don't arrest me. And there it is, the great fortress of Raman. Right, now how do we get in? Hmm, that looks assuredly locked. But I've heard you can get inside. Вот эта, вот эта дверь, ага. после его еще один дверь, ага. стукни, угу. они тебе номер скажет, ага. позвонишь, ага. пацан придет, ключ у него, ага. 
Окей. Он откроет. Хорошо, понял. Не это, а следующий. 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 Uh -huh. Стукни, uh -huh. выйдет женщина. И у него ключ. Uh -huh. У другого пацана. Сверху. Поэтому я тебе туда не посылаю. Uh -huh. Ты иди там, стукни, скажи. Он тебе номер скажет, okay. позвонишь. Или Все попросить, помню. чтобы она позвонила. Как? Сложный процесс. Давай. Хорошо, давай. Спасибо большое. Вау. Knock on that door. Not that one, but the next one will give you a number. You call the number. A man comes, he gives you a key. You unlock the fortress. Wow. Я турист, и я хотел ну, выходить в твою крепость. Это можно? Да. Спасибо. Я сейчас туда открою. Окей, хорошо, спасибо. Окей, мы в лак. Это не бабушка. Но это нормально. Мы будем идти туда, не так интересно? Зайдешь, я закрою, я отсюда буду смотреть. Ага, ага. Когда ты сюда придешь, пульту открою, хорошо? Хорошо, да. да. Не буду здесь долго. А, нет, нет, минут. нет. Нет, я буду, нет, я буду стоять там смотреть, нет. Вот ну, я закрываю, пишу, что чужой вкусный заход из-за этого. Ага, конечно. Вау, <laughs> крутой, окей. Okay. А сюда можно поднять, я отсюда ага, тоже. Ага. 12 века, да? Вот, на углу. Вот там можно подняться. Вот сюда. Да. Там туда можно садить, немножко там осторожно будет, да? Осторожно? У вас здесь. Окей, окей. Понял. Все будет хорошо. Спасибо. Вау. 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 Because it's very steep, he said. I don't actually. Oh, it's through here. I thought it was like. I thought it was uh, locked, but no, it's just a gate. Oh my goodness. Oh. Oh, you probably can't see any of this. But we're in. Oh, these steps are so eroded, they're, they're rounded. Very easy to slip off. Oh, my wow. Oh. Okay. <clears throat> oh, good lord. Oh, not even the luxury of a handrail on this one. Fucking hell. I assume there aren't such things as health and safety inspections in Azerbaijan. I do not think that would pass it. Wait, so... Oh, God. Jesus Christ. Oh. Oh. 
Oh my god. <clears throat> Oof, that was treacherous. We made it, and here we are. Behold. The abandoned petrochemical industrial wasteland of suburban Baku. Isn't it a beauty? Look at that, almost as far as the eye can see. These, well, structures, there's some nodding donkeys, there's some just sort of, just sort of metal contraptions of some sort. Can't pretend to know much about the oil extraction process, but yeah, it's quite a sight. That's it. I mean, it's a 12th century fortress, and I can't frankly tell you much more about it than that, because there wasn't any more about it on the Wikipedia page. So this is what you get. But the main reason I came here is because I knew I'd get a view of this wasteland. Now, we, we, do, we do like a, a post-apocalyptic petrochemical wasteland here on this channel never pass up an opportunity to get acquainted with one. All right, I think that'll do me. Now, of course, the most dangerous part of climbing anything is the descent. So, um, yeah. So sketchy. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, that's so insecure. Look how it's flexing. If that broke, I think I'd be a goner. Wow. Wow. This experience was five minutes. It's good to see that money's going somewhere. Oof. Five minutes, about three dollars or something, or three billion shares in spare bank. This one, at least you get a hammer up, which is courteous. Well, I think that's me done. Let's get out. Oh, yeah, forgot. Lock me in. Salam. Sure. Спасибо. Сердце ходит с пристера, но. Спасибо. Мне как понравится? Да, 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 да. Очень интересный вид. Вот и останки. Ну, качалки, не, не знаю, как сказать, как назвать это. Но они еще работают? Да, работают. Да, да, есть еще нефть. Нефть, нефть. Да, но, но большинство в Каспийском море, да? Но... Да, на Каспийском море, а -а -а. да, все работают. Все они работают. Хорошо. Спасибо большое. Пожалуйста, Ага. Хорошего дня, до свидания. Спасибо. Yeah, he says some of those things, uh, some of the sun still work. Um, so let's, um, yeah, let's get down there and um, get up close and personal with one. I've never seen a, a nodding donkey up close, so that'll be cool. 
Right, how should we get down? Well, the centre of Baku, as I said, is a pretty amazing place. Tall, gleaming buildings, you can't find a spot of litter. It's a real show of wealth and development. Um, and it comes from oil. That's the backbone of the, of the economy, as I said. Um, but it comes at a cost, and Azerbaijan does have a very poor record on its environment. For example, I don't think water should be that colour. Dirty business. I don't really know whether I'm allowed to go down these roads. I'd like to, but they are active. I've also just seen a sign saying no photography. Probably they don't want you to see how grim it is just outside of the sparkling centre of Baku. I'm going to try and walk among them a little bit. There's no sign saying private, so yeah. But I am filming, so hopefully, hopefully I don't get caught. What a nightmarish place. Well, the security guard just turned me back. I can't go and walk amongst them, which makes sense. They are, it is active industry. Um, but uh, I mean, it's, it's quite intensive up here. There's really a lot of stuff going on. Um, but down here seems a little bit more sparse. It's interesting, I wasn't filming because I wanted him to, to let me uh, they walk around for a bit. Um, but he did say, you know, you, need, you should go to the city. This is, you don't want to be here. This is. This is not, this is not nice. Um, and uh, yeah, it, it isn't to be fair. And here's one that stopped working many moons ago. something to you know in the gloaming walk through a landscape like this over there I see a pack of stray dogs running across this wasteland here's a load of trash an open sewer and and these these machines extracting this liquid gold from the ground some of them no longer operational, but some of them are. Um, this is the backbone of the Azerbaijan economy. Um, in fact, this not so much. Uh, most of the oil now is extracted, is, is deep reserves in the Caspian Sea. Back in the day, they didn't have the technology to extract it during Soviet times. But now there is a technology and now Western companies have come, now they're extracting this, this deep water uh, oil. And it's what's, ma it's what's made Azerbaijan comparatively rich. Um, and something they're very proud of. But this... Well, this is the worst of the lot. It's just this pool of thick black sludge. And I'll tell you the stench is pretty extraordinary too. There's your pack of stray dogs over there running around this hellscape. Of course this place is not special. Behind each of our lives, crammed with machines and motion, lies a stinking midden and good land laid to waste. Stray dogs scampered over the riven, lifeless earth. 
I decided that whatever they were looking for, they were better suited to this place than me. And so I headed home.